Uh, this is the screenshot of FlexView computer uh, which is connected to RTFlex engine 50D. Uh, today I will explain you uh, the adjustment of injection begin offset. So any parameter which you want to change uh, we need to enter the password. Once you click on this it will ask for a password. The password here for this is FluxView uh, where V is capital. Once you enter this, this uh, uh, we can change the parameter and after 15 minutes this will come to normal. That means uh, if you want to change any parameter after 15 minutes again you have to enter the password. So these are you can see this is the, this is the screen uh, where you can see the average is uh, showing 0.1 here. Uh, so I will go to the next screen uh, to explain you in more detail. Uh, next screen you can see uh, the average is 0.1 this actually this average should remain in the range of less than uh, plus or minus 0.2 degrees so should this should remain in this range and uh, today we are going to adjust unit number 7 uh, in such a way that we reduce this to uh, minus 0.2 degrees actually this field uh, usually is used to balance the cylinder load uh, between separate units by either advancing or retarding a unit uh, either in the range uh, plus 1.5 degrees uh, for later injection or minus 1.5 degrees earlier injection. So I will go to the next slide uh, uh, to show you how we have actually done it. Okay, So once you click on unit number 7 uh, what will happen is the color will change into yellow so you have to press the shift key and move the arrow up or down so you uh, increase the setting in small steps so for me uh, I wanted to reduce from minus 0.3 to minus 0.2 once you bring it to minus 0.2 uh, then what you do is uh, press shift key and enter the color will change from yellow to black then the correction has been done so we actually did this for unit number 7 uh, range change from minus 0.3 to 0.2 degrees minus point is that is retarded for balancing of the uh, cylinder load this was done when the engine was running so you should be very careful uh, while doing this uh, particular parameter change uh, it should be done in small steps and looking into all the parameters. Uh, I hope you understood and I will explain uh, most of the things in the next slide one by one. Hope uh, you will understand uh, the Arctic Flex Engine 50D in a better way. Thank you.